Research complete. Hello friends, my name is Pradeek Kumar. Let's start a new tool about how we can create a radar project. Okay, help of LabVIEW plus Arduino. Okay, now let's start. First, we need some hardware. Okay. Uh, okay, guys. First, you need Arduino, you know. Okay, second is servo motor. You see. And I attached an ultrasonic sensor. Like you see, this is ultrasonic sensor. Okay, and let's uh, concentrate on the wiring diagram. Okay, you see in the ultrasonic sensor have a four pins VCC, TRIG, ECHO and GND. Okay, VCC you need to connect to the VCC of your Arduino, you know, 5 volt. Okay, I am using this uh, uh, breadboard. Okay, positive. I am connected to the 5 volt here. Okay, you need to connect 5 volt here. And servo motor, you see, these are servo motor connections. Okay, and uh, in the brown color if your ground. Okay, and center red color is your power supply VCC 5 volt and uh, you see uh, green wire I already connected the 5 volt okay and uh, GND connect to the GND ground and last one is yellow color this is signal okay you need to connect uh, pin number uh, uh, yes pin number uh, 10 okay pin number 10 okay now you see and uh, this one is your ECHO pin you need to connect pin number 9 and another one is TRIG pin you need to connect pin number 10 okay in the programming already declare everything okay guys and now let's concentrate on the programming okay first open Arduino you know okay okay you can download this code uh, from description okay now you see and let's concentrate you see a uh, constant in TRIG pin pin number 9 of your ultrasonic sensor and ECHO pin uh, connect to pin number 10 of your ultrasonic sensor okay and last one is your servo motor and you see so my servo dot attach pin number 11 okay this is your connection of hardware okay everything is done and uh, hash include servo this is library okay help of servo help of library we create a one variable that is my servo okay now uh, this is a simple uh, variable okay duration distance and p this is for ultrasonic sensor okay now you see pin mode TRIG pin output okay ultrasonic pin uh, one pin is out and other pin is input okay TRIG pin is out and ECHO pin is input this is the board rate of your ultrasonic sensor okay now let's come on the word loop okay if serial dot available now if this serial monitor is available that time this function is execute that time this function is execute okay now uh, anything like I am click to this one and you see right now it's not working we need to enter any value or any character like and click to enter and now you see it's working okay that's why i um, uh, declare this code if serial monitor is serial dot available that time this condition is execute okay and in this condition i uh, uh, enter uh, i write uh, some code of servo motor and ultrasonic sensor now this is servo motor for pause pause i create a one variable uh, you see simple pause okay starting 0 and this is a for loop 0 to 180 okay and this is plus plus by 10 okay 0 10 20 30 40 50 to 180 okay your servo motor is rotate 0 to 180 degree okay help of this condition okay and in this between you see my servo rotate right position pause is your this angle okay uh, that's why your servo motor is rotate 10 20 30 40 50 60 to 180 degree okay help of this uh, condition okay and serial dot print and pause it uh, this declare your servo position in your serial monitor okay help of this we read uh, this position in our lab view done okay and this is uh, this program is your ultrasonic okay digital uh, right pin first low microseconds okay and delay uh, 2 microsecond after its trigger pin is high 10 microseconds your trigger pin is low okay this is the code of your ultrasonic sensor and this is your uh, distance okay distance equal to duration into 0 0.0343 divided by 2 you can change as per your requirement okay and p p i already declare the variable you see float p okay help of p equal to distance i am multiply 1000 because in the lab view uh, we can read uh, multiple integer value that time i am uh, multiply 1000 and in the lab view and you see in the lab view i divided same by 1000 okay done 
yes now the next one uh, next condition is your uh, servo motor or uh, uh, reverse rotation okay now pose 180 and pose greater than 0 and pose minus 10 okay uh, right now condition is if your servo motor is rotated 0 to 180 after th uh, this condition execute 180 to 0 okay servo motor is rotated 0 to 180 180 to 0 continuously okay this program is same okay uh, right now my servo rotate right pose uh, this pose is like 180 then uh, 180 170 160 to 0 okay everything is done now upload your program to your Arduino you know I have already uploaded okay now I minimize this one now let's concentrate on the lab view programming okay and this code uh, link in description go and download because uh, this program I take from internet okay and uh, uh, help by my teacher okay now what you do uh, first go and download this project okay after that I am uh, tell you about everything okay now you see about uh, this icons you already know right click here and let's um, click to label okay this is visa open right click here and come to instrument io and visa now pin and you see visa open advance and you see this is visa open drag here like this okay uh, next one is visa right and you see this is visa right drag here next is visa read drag here next again visa read why i'm uh, take two read one is for ultrasonic other is for servo okay that's done and one is you need to close like uh, like this is your close icon okay done okay and this library i taken from, uh, from internet okay and uh, that's why i'm giving the link in description go and download it okay now i deleted this one everything is same can you see this is the input uh, right click and create a control enter numeric value okay you need to enter any value for uh, activate your serial monitor okay and uh, this is visa read uh, you need to uh, create control byte servo okay you need to enter uh, some byte okay as per your uh, integer length okay and uh, same uh, for visa right for this is for ultrasonic okay you see okay and uh, uh, right click here and create an indicator for servo rotation and uh, in this uh, your servo rotation is uh, visible here in this icon servo rotation and ultrasonic uh, distance declare here okay and you see uh, right now i'm uh, created this one conversion okay uh, now you see uh, string to number okay why i'm do this one because uh, in the arduino programming i uh, create a one uh, logic distance into 1000 okay for increase uh, number of bytes okay that's why uh, same uh, i divide by 1000 for take a uh, default value or we can say uh, take a, a perfect value of our distance okay this is your ultrasonic distance okay and help of this one right click and create a visible label this is bundle okay okay this is bundle and this is bundle array okay uh, in the bundle uh, what you do first we need to enter our servo uh, servo location or we can say servo rotation okay angle and second one you need to ultrasonic distance okay and after that you need to connect to this terminal this is data array and remember you can change as per uh, like uh, like i'm uh, tell you about this thing okay like if you need to change this size you can enter uh, in this like uh, you can enter any value to change height or width okay and this is a point you can change to line also and point is your red point and this is the 20 is your uh, your circle uh, we can say circle uh, diameter okay now I am enter 40 then it's increase now all done and you see they have one icon double click this one okay and help they have a lots of parameters and this is minimum and maximum 0 to 50 okay and you see in the starting the center is 0 and in the uh, end uh, is 50 okay you can change help of this one okay but right now i'm take a 50 okay otherwise let's i'm take a 10 okay done i'm enter here 10 okay everything is done now double click here okay now save this project okay all done now what you do let's connect your Arduino you know okay and let's uh, select com uh, this is my com okay I'm entering a byte servo for uh, 5 and ultrasonic 20 okay okay now you need to enter any value like I'm enter P and click to enter okay uh, but it's not working now what you do uh, let's remove your Arduino okay and again connect it okay and let's uh, refresh and let's select your uh, com 18 now click to run okay now you need to enter value p like this now it's working well okay and you see
ओके एंड सर रोटेशन इज यू सी ट्वेंटी टेन जीरो देन टेन ट्वेंटी थर्टी फोर्टी लाइक दिस एंड अल्ट्रासोनिक डिस्टेंस इज सिक्सटीन सेवनटीन थर्टीन फिफ्टी सिक्स लाइक दिस ओके नाउ वॉट यू डू एंड यू सी वन आई टेक हैंड नियर बाय दिस सेंसर एंड इन द लाइव यू सी इन द रेंज यू सी सिक्स फाइव फोर ओके रेड रोट इज डिक्लेयर ओके लेट्स अगेन यू सी इन द लाइव यू फोर फोर द डिस्टेंस सिक्स एट लाइक दिस ओके इट्स वर्किंग परफेक्टली ओके नाउ अगेन लेट्स सी सी इन द लाइव यू फाइव फोर लाइक दिस ओके इट्स परफेक्ट वर्किंग ओके ओके थैंक यू सो मच इफ यू लाइक दिस वीडियो प्लीज लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब अवर चैनल थैंक यू सो मच गाइज